Shalom Habrim. I'm Stephen Benun. You're watching Israeli News Live, and we just ran across a very important prophetic scripture that we wanted to share with you in regards to the Syrian refugee crisis around the world, especially those going up into Europe and also into the United States and other places. Uh, we do know that there's refugees in Turkey as well as Saudi Arabia there. But Nahum the prophet has very much uh, prophesied a great deal regarding uh, Nineveh specifically, which is in uh, northwest northern Iraq there near Mosul. And we're going to be going to that later today, talking about what's going on there. But a very interesting scripture there in Nahum in the third chapter, the 18th and 19th verse, actually tells us what will happen to these refugees. I think you ought to hear this. So let's listen to what it says here. Thy shepherds slumber, O king of Assyria. Remember, king of Assyria was the, the Assyrian region which also encompasses modern-day Nineveh. Uh, so it's kind of inter interesting that he says the king of Assyria covers Syria, uh, uh, parts of Iraq, and also parts of Jordan. But specifically, we're looking at Syria because this is where the refugee crisis is going on. Uh, but then again, there's others that had to flee as well, even in the northern parts of Iraq, like Mosul and Nineveh, etc., but he says, Thy shepherds slumber, O king of Assyria, thy nobles shall dwell in the dust. Thy people is scattered upon the mountains, and no man gathereth them. The refugees of Syria are not going to be going back home. You are literally looking at the very end of days. We are looking at the last prophetic stage of human history. And the refugees that you see on your screen now and behind me there are the refugees from Syria that have been sent to all different parts of the world there that are fleeing from uh, the war-torn region there. It is only going to get worse. It says in verse 19, the closing uh, verse there, There is no healing of thy bruise. Thy wound is grievous. All that hear the, the, the brute of thee shall clap the hands over thee, for upon whom hath not that thy wickedness passed continually. It's a very serious situation to say the least there. I can't wait to take you into the prophecies regarding Nineveh, the things that are coming up right now. There's many prophecies that are speaking about Nineveh's total destruction, Mosul, uh, where we are seeing a lot of the conflict going on right now. Turkey is there. The United States has its special forces there in Mosul. Uh, and, of course, Iraq is, is, is de demanding for the, for the removal of the Turkish forces in that region. And if talks don't go very well very soon with Russia, and uh, with the Defense Minister Lavrov and Secretary of State John Kerry, who's in Moscow today for meetings there with uh, the Defense Minister uh, Lavrov, then we can certainly count on the fact that it's going to be very ugly, uh, not only in Syria, but it looks like the Russia may end up backing Iraq and helping uh, oust Turkey. A lot of tensions have been rising in the days and, and also in the days ahead. I'm Stephen Benoon. You're watching Israeli News Live. Shalom.